Welcome to SRB TV. We are here. Hello everyone, welcome to our episode of SRB TV. I'm Chris. Oh, Christopher. And on today's episode, we're continuing with Loki with Season 1, Episode 3. Lamentous. So previously on Loki, uh, Loki figured out that the other Loki pretty much. pretty much found out where the other Loki had been hiding because they couldn't find him. So the other Loki figured out that the, the, the Loki, our Loki figured out that the other Loki was hiding in places that were doomed to be destroyed. They were, they were getting apocalypse. Right. They were about to be destroyed. They were just about to be destroyed. Like apocalypse level because that's location. where a lot of the feedback didn't never picked up anything because the apocalypse was already happening. There's no need to keep track of it. So that's where he discovered it. Except when they had to went to Pompeii, and that's when they had that little moment with Pompeii and realized there's no, there's nothing that's throwing them off. So he finally we finally encountered the other Loki, who happens to be a female. Female Loki. And yeah. it looks like their grand plan was to f just to really branch out the entire uh, main timeline. Yeah, they, they, they What she did, what she did, is that she literally pretty much grabbed the the typical machine they used to kind of like fix that whatever moment happened. But toss it into multiple timelines, and that's where it created pretty branch much branched out. out and gave us multiple timelines. Which, again, that's what the TVA is trying to avoid because of the whole hey, you know, it's going to cause another war. And before he Loki could explain anything to Agent Mobius, he went uh, Loki chased after female Loki. Because again, knowing Loki, his interests are always there. Are always there. It's like he's interested when something like this happens. It's like he wants more information. He's like, what's going on? It's like, he wants more info, he needs to find out more info, and whether it's, it's either it's gonna aid him, or it's something he could bring back to the TVA. You know, one of those two, it's, that's what it is. So, enough said, let's just get dive into this. I think we wanna know more information, who she is, what she is, and all of this information. So, let's dive in, into this again for Loki, season one, episode three. So, let's do this. Wait, do we have an official name? I already told you that in the beginning. Oh, you usually say it before we I, start. I, I don't have to say it again. Oh, okay. Twice. Again. Here we go. Again. It's when you sit something so cold. It's brain freeze associated with coldness. Got it. Wait, I'm being serious. So it permeates the roof of your mouth and it freezes the synapses in your brain. So your memories are literally frozen in place. Okay. That's absolutely not true. It is. Okay, try it. So, so we be beginning with Green Freeze. Sure. She's the girl from the beginning. You recognize her? The one that they took that she took over and was kidnapped. Sorry, what? Yes, yeah, see? Oh. Hey. How okay. You? Thank you. Seriously, then, you know you can tell me anything. I think she's in her mind, mid mid manipulating her, yeah. Okay, I was gonna say, this is an odd flashback. I swear to God, they saved her in Tahiti. Okay. They just died. They just died. Yeah, probably just died. It doesn't work there, remember? <laughs> I forgot those rides do that. Yeah, her abilities don't work there. Yeah, she doesn't realize that. Look, Arlo, she knows that already. Yeah, she knows that. She doesn't. So when she tried doing it, she's like, what the hell? God damn! She can fight, though. She's definitely more, um, handicapped, definitely capable than, um, Arlo, she. That's where he realized where they're at. He's in the middle of his knives. Yeah, the knives. Yeah, there you go. Because he's right, right in front of his locker. Few questions. Question. You have nothing else better to do. Rude. Rude. Are you sure you're a Loki? You're in my way. You are my way. You are my way. You are my way. That's an interesting line. I thought perhaps we could work together. Come any closer and I'll kill him. She doesn't care. Go for it. Oh, he still had the... Yeah, no, he grabbed it from her. Yeah. 
and it went back, went somewhere. Wait, when? The future. Oh my god, this thought cyberpunk. <laughs> To get that thing recharged. That's the only reason you saved me out there. No, he wants fucking answers. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, sure. That too. Or if you just slaughter each other here in this abandoned mining shack. What do you say? Good for me. The plan you interrupted was years in the making. Okay. The ultimate power vacuum, and then just walk away. I'd never have done that. Well, I'm not you. She has a reason. That's why it's like there's more to it. Why? To get that. Um, my, I have a couple guesses. Maybe um, she found out that the, the three little time. She did, maybe. Uh, that's why I said she found out the truth about them. Maybe. Maybe they. She wants to go on full force, and he's just like, really? What did he just say? What did he, what he just fucking say? Remarkable that you ever made it as far as you did. Uh, yeah. Sorry about that. Not me. I enjoyed it. Oh, I, I did too. I did too. I'm going to assure you, despite my acquaintance. Wait for it. She's going to shoot him because she didn't like her husband. Oh dear. Patrice? She's going to shoot. She's going to shoot him because he doesn't like. Because she never liked her husband or she killed her husband. I don't know. You're as beautiful as to be fair, never liked my husband. We're doing this one my way. Yeah. Have a look. Like someone with a shit plan. It's a great plan. <laughs> 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 she likes going in full force, and he's more like, I, you know, we got things. things She's through. like, she goes from one to eleven almost instantaneously. You sure she was your mother? Uh, no, she's not actually. I was adopted. They did a spoiler for you. Sorry about that. No, I knew I was adopted. What? <laughs> Who told you? Who told you? Yeah. Did they not tell you? No. No. She was told. I mean, they did eventually. Yeah. Love is mischief, then. What about brother? Or sister? <laughs> hey, you know. So she wasn't raised like he was. Is never knew her mother. Taught magic herself. Taught shot herself the ma of magic. Uh, something I or I I feel like it. Yeah. Feels like he's trying to sing it to see if she would. Man, time and love the Did a Thor thing. That was a cool yeah. magic Thor. He's like, another! No, I'm just full. But bear in mind, I'm very full. Now, I need you to try this. It has very nicely with the figgy pawn. Who's got the figgy pawn? Well, you just have to take my word with the figgy pawn. It's a uniform. We're meant to be laying down. There is a simple explanation. Loki being drunk or Loki just plain stupid. Damn. Oh, will you stop it? Fucking sick comment thing, shit. Yes, it did. You should try it sometime. Who works at the TVA was created by the timekeepers. 
That's ridiculous. They're all variants, just like us. There are. They don't know that. They're all variants. So the TVA and they don't know about it, and they don't know the about TVA it. TVA resets people's brains and turns them into aliens. one of them. That's right. He's like, and they don't know they're variants. It could explain Agent Mobius's love for jet skis. Like that little bit, of, like a, a piece of him from who he really was. Do we have to do this? Really? We don't have time for this. Season one, episode three. Oh yes. So yeah, we got to meet, find out more about other Loki. He Sylvie. Sylvie, pretty much. So yeah. what we do know about her now is a little bit so far. She was she wasn't raised by the Queen of Asgard. She, she never was, knew her mother. That's what she they never knew her mother. Uh, she found she almost immediately found out she was part for Australian. Yeah, yeah. She found out she was she. They told her that she was. They did tell her she was fully adopted. Wow. You know? Loki learned a lot of his stuff from his mother. She had to learn a lot of stuff on her own. She learned just a little bit of her magic on her own. Just that bit of it that she knows of. And, um, and that's all we know so far. That's that's really we. we, um, we the biggest takeaway we also got as well is that it does seem like. A TVA oh, hires there's more, yeah, there's more. It's, it's 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 more it's more on the TVA this time around where it's like some new interesting tidbit where it's like they they hire oh, yeah cool photos pretty much as if they knew they were there um it the t it's as if the TVA they grab variants wipe the memory and then make them work for them yeah you know it's not that it's not that they're from there or they're they were originally from there no. They actually, that, that's why even he's like, wait a minute. Okay. Sorry, at first it felt like it was like extra scene, sorry. But, no, it's it's very interesting. So that's, so it's like we're learning more about the TVA and how they, they're operating. So it's very, very interesting of how they operate so far. So that's why, like you said, it makes sense with the whole, with Mobius, with the whole jet skis. That could be a bit of like his, his original life. Le leaking out a little bit, where he's, his interest of like uh, jet skis, you yeah. know, his fascination with them, you know. So that's 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 some new tidbit there. Um, but it's, it, we got a little bit on on Sylvie, pretty much, where it's like she doesn't like being called Loki whatsoever. That's why even that's why and one she's thing. been on this mission for years now, for a few years now, you know, trying to everything leading up to the point where she was going to go in to the TVA. She was already in there and things like that, but he kind of. You know, ruined that completely. So it's very interesting. You know, it's like we're getting a little bit more information about her and who she is and stuff like that. Because that's why I even like the scene where it's like, I told you everything about myself. I barely know anything about you. So it's like, I need more information about you. Like, I like how it's like that mind thing she does. Loki doesn't know how to use it. Mm -hmm. He doesn't know he can do that. You know, that's why he was asking, how does that work exactly? Because even he doesn't know. Yeah, you know, but it's interesting. Like I said, I like where they're going so far because it's like we're learning a little bit about her, but also like a little bit. We you know we learn a little bit about the TVA and what's happening and stuff like that. We still don't know exactly why she caused the the split, maybe to distract everybody so she. Can yeah, we don't know. That's why like I said we don't know anything on why she's doing that. So I think that's 
again, he wants to, he's still trying to learn more about her, but he's also trying to learn why she's doing this. Why did this happen? You know, it's like, and it's taking her this long. It's like, what happened exactly? Yeah. You know, that's why I was just laughing there as well with the, you know, talking about, do you have a brother or a sister? You know, something like that. It's like, you know, trying to compare the differences or anything like that. You know, that's, that's the question. And like I said, it, it, it's given us more of like questions of like what's going on here. Mm -hmm. What's that? Even more questions on <laughs> on the TVA, you know, uh, themselves of like who they really are. Where it's like yeah, that's where he's like he was, he just got you know the history to be going. Wait a minute. So they are variants, you know. But it's like but they don't remember who they are. That's why I like it when he's like she's like the girl. It's like I had to take her. I had to take her back hundreds of years. And, like and this it also kind of explains why she the, the head lady even said that's why the the three are are focused on this case specifically because she knows the truth. I think yeah, she knows she she knows the truth about everything about the TVA, mm -hmm. you know. And that's the question I have there. It's like, is the TVA very it, really necessary at this point? That's the question now. Is are they necessary or are they not necessary? What, what that that's the big big question that's coming out of this now overall so that's what we got out of this episode is we got a little bit we got a little bit information about who she is the name she goes by and of course a little bit to bit on on Sylvia uh, on the TVA itself as well you know um, interesting it's an interesting but interesting moments as well I love the the at last scene that they had was very phenomenal. They did a great. They did a great. They yeah. tried doing that single shot. I could tell where they probably made the cuts. Um, for, you know, for the certain scenes where it's like a single shot. But that was a great scene that they did there. You know, the way they were moving, everything was like out of control. They had to keep everything flowing and going through. Um, but now the big question we have is what's next? Because that was our last resource. Yeah. You know, and it's like it's, you assume they 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 assumed that also then happened with the ship where it had problems taking off. No. It was just destroyed by the moon. That was it. Before it even was about to take off, it was destroyed by the moon. Yeah. You know, so... Uh, I, uh, overall, interesting episode. Um, I do like that moment where he caught the, the whole pillar, though. That was, like, awesome. He that's pretty awesome. it back. You know, but it was a good episode. It was a solid good episode. We got, we got a little bit more information of who she is and what's going on. And, you know, even though it gave us more questions and stuff like that, as always. Uh, and Loki, of course, Loki's just trying to find out what's going on. And, you know, more he's he's getting more information himself because he's now at this point, he's us. We're trying mm -hmm. to get more information on what's going on, what's happening because it's yeah. like he's tossed in the middle of this, and now it's like still trying to figure out what's their next move, what's their next thing they have to do to try to get out of this situation because now they're in an apocalypse that they can't be detected. You know, so it's like how they can get out of this unless there's a surprise character that comes up. Or a surprise, you know, something that they find or find out that gets them to maybe another time period. Who knows? So, but I enjoyed the episode. I see why it was called Lamentus because that that's where they were at is on uh, Lamentus one. Yeah. So other than that, if you're new to the channel, you hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And I feel like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about. Disney Plus original MCU series. Hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys thought of this episode. Did you enjoy this episode? Have a, a favorite part, favorite moment in this episode that really stood out for you? Any tidbits that they tossed in here that, I don't know, we may have missed on, that little hints here and there. Um, like I, I do like the little, uh, 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 what was that? I think I mentioned it during one in our reaction, a little uh, nod they, they made to a certain event or a certain thing. but. You know, oh no, no, to a certain thing about, you know, you know, the, the Norse mythology, pretty much how, pretty much, you know, Loki is uh, bi, you know, gender and stuff like that. Gender and those, fluid, yeah. And gender fluid as well. So it, like, that's why I like how she dropped, dropped in going any lucky girl or guy, you know, type of situation. So I do like how they dropped that as well. But like you said, I mean, let us know in the comments down below. Put down what you thought of our reaction overall to this episode. Um, but most importantly, thank you for watching. And of course, on the next episode of SRB TV Dealing next with Loki, Tuesday. we will be tackling Season 1, Episode 4. So, until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very not-so-cyberpunk-filled episode of SRB TV. Another good nod. See you Later.
Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out any of our previous reactions, as well as one of our other SRB shows, check out one of the playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can find us on Twitter and Stardust at Super React Bros. As well as on Facebook at Super Reaction Bros.